Some great lighting right there. <laughs> this is some quality content. <laughs> Alright, sure. Let's go. Oh, it's already recording. <laughs> <laughs> Greetings, nerds! <laughs> look, you can see our faces. Wow, look at that. You That's can see how new. busted my hair looks. Actually, it looks fine. <laughs> What's poppin'? <laughs> Great. I'm Glitch. <laughs> I'm Cakey. <laughs> and today we're playing a game called Blameless. It's Spooky Week, aka our slow descent into madness. <laughs> but I uh, can't wait so... till 12 days of Christmas. Oh, God. <laughs> Actually, I think my, one of my last classes is like December 3rd. So, like, I'll be ready to go for that. <laughs> But, oh yeah, the ideal Spooky Week scenario is a video a day up leading up until Halloween. It is currently three days until Halloween, and we have uploaded two videos. <laughs> we will try to have eight videos out by Halloween. Get ready for some garbage. <laughs> Get ready for some double uploads. <laughs> Triple uploads. <laughs> We're just gonna quadruple <laughs> uploads. <laughs> just gonna dump a ton of videos on you on Halloween. <laughs> <laughs> and we upload two videos a day. <laughs> From now until Thursday, we'll be fine. <laughs> anyway, it has not been going well. It hasn't been going well. Not all of it's been our fault. One of the Literally videos... almost none of it's been our fault. Yeah. For a change. <laughs> but usually when we fail at YouTube, it's just because of our own incompetence. But this time around. <laughs> God. <laughs> you just <laughs> launched your head into the webcam. You look so much bigger than me. Hello, I promise I'm not a... a a, a gnome. <laughs> no, you're not in the way. <laughs> Why do you look so much smaller? You're just a lot closer than I am. Uh, anyway, for once it's not our fault. For we've been having a myriad of technical difficulties. Literally all like of most games. of the games that we have attempted to record, some of which cost money. Real money. <laughs> Just don't work. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna new game. So this is a game called Blameless. Right. I think it's gonna explain the story to you. I hope you can hear this narration. They probably can't. <laughs> What in the world is going on? <laughs> Alright, that's fine. 
That's some staticky audio. Sure is, Famal M. Let's do this. <laughs> It's a very underwhelming reaction to being assaulted. <laughs> <laughs> There's some dust falling from the ceiling. Alright, this looks nice. Yeah. I'm like impressed with this. Oh, oh bar is it's lagging again. Do you think <laughs> it's the webcam or do you think it's the game? I have no idea. We could try it without the webcam. God, how do we start the whole game? Fine. Oh wait, no, it might not actually. You just gotta put it in windowed mode. Yeah, sometimes I thought maybe <laughs> it wouldn't let us. I'm gonna. S anyway, we're gonna see if this runs smoothly without the webcam. Um, if that's the reason why Moons of Madness didn't work, I will lose my mind. Click right mouse button to reverse an action. Is that all your phone? Alright, so I think that is our phone. Did Nokia even ever make, like, not flip phones? phones? Yeah. Um, <laughs> they might have. Maybe that's Perhaps. why they used Nokia, though. They were like, I can get away with that. I think they spelled it weird, too. I think they put the A before the I. <laughs> it's like they don't have to no do... No Kai. <laughs> they don't have to make, like, a distracting fake brand. Mm hmm But they don't have to worry about getting sued. Yeah. What is this? Is this something? It's a clamp. Oh. Can you not use it as a weapon? I don't know if that's like a has. Okay, this game's a bit laggy, but it's still the. <laughs> it's still working. Yeah. Now we have to actually start getting apprehensive about the fact that we're playing a horror game. It's been going to the point where I've felt no fear, no <laughs> trepidation at all. Because it's like, I'm more scared that the game's just not gonna work. <laughs> Look, tables that are reasonable sizes, proportionally. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's kind of a tall table, but if it's like a working table, that kind of like a work... Yeah, work tables tend to be taller. Yeah. Or maybe we're just short. Uh, <laughs> what, Both I are jump? reasonable. Oh, I can jump. You okay. can jump. Some red jump. pipes. Are you sure that's not where the red said? No, that's much more red than the pipes. Never mind. Conk somebody with you, clamp. I don't know. I don't. It's not one of the mouse buttons if I can. That's fair. So this is like a puzzle game. We gotta, like, bust our way out of here. Okay. <laughs> Window? Uh, logically, yes, but game says no. <laughs> key? Was there a key? No, I just mean maybe there's a key somewhere. <laughs> Perhaps. <sighs> I see nothing. Um, I'm assuming it probably has something to do with this. Probably. Table. Follow the cords. The yellow cord. There's a little question mark on the ground near the blood. There sure is. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I mean, some dude literally just conked you out with a metal god. I think it's probably safe to assume that he's done this before. 
want the plant back. <laughs> I don't even know if we could use it, but I just feel safe <laughs> with the clamp. I'm not sure if I can pick it. Okay, wait. There we go. Sick. Be really upset if we couldn't <laughs> pick it back. I really up think again. it's got something to do with the yellow wire. Right. Well, you're the one who told me to cease. Yeah. I thought maybe it was important. It is not. Hello. Does not appear to lead anywhere at all. Um. Well. The music is building, and I don't like that at all. <laughs> mm. <laughs> they don't give you a lot to go off of. No, they don't. Oh, wait. Question mark. Oh, wait. I have to put this down. That's kind of annoying. <laughs> Vice. I know what a vice is now. Well, so you got probably put something in the clamp. <laughs> Can't put the clamp in the clamp. Is there something you like maybe to bust open or? get the impression this was like a very jump scary type of game. Mm -hmm. Why wouldn't some dude invite you to do interior design on a house that is in this current state? Uh, cause they're building it so they probably wanted like advice on how to build it well. He's know. also a motor, so maybe he yeah, doesn't he care. kind of just <laughs> wanted you to. I get the impression he just wanted to lure you here to kill you, because <laughs> he was also inviting an architect to talk about interior design. That's true. Which doesn't seem like the most logical course of action. I just sort of assumed they meant like not interior design in like a furniture way, mm -hmm. but like interior design in like a. Architect y kind of way. Yeah, like just like the general design of a building, which wouldn't be interior necessarily, but mm -hmm. I thought it was just a mistake. <laughs> you sure that wire doesn't go anywhere? It doesn't. Can you see where it goes? No, well, that's what I'm trying to do. It just goes back like under the table. Okay. You can't crouch in this game. Man, they really don't give you much. <laughs> no, they don't. Like, what am I supposed to do? You can also phase through these bricks, but that's okay, I guess. I'm in a very forgiving mood to anything <laughs> that functions, but I'm not sure how much longer I could take. Nothing happening. <sighs> Uh, before I start to get really irritated again. <laughs> I mean, we can't interact with that much in the womb. I feel like it shouldn't be that hard. No, it shouldn't, but I keep missing things we can interact with, so... <gasps> Hello. Definitely isn't supposed to take this long. No, definitely not. Am I missing something? What am I missing? I mean, obviously, I'm missing something. Otherwise, <laughs> <laughs> we'd be out of this room, but. 
Why are we so bad at video games? <laughs> I mean, tell us where they're, they're te- tell me where there's supposed to be something. Like, Clearly somewhere. Ceiling? Oh. Oh, it's on the ceiling. Huh. Can you... You have to get into the attic. I guess I can't get up there then? I guess. Look for a crowbar or something. A box where we could move. Maybe a way to parkour up there. Someone said there's parkour in this game, right? I don't know. No, I don't remember that. I thought that's what it might have been a different game that we were looking at, but I thought it was this one. So I guess we need to find something to stand on or something to pry it open with. Yeah. Could this, like, not serve that purpose? Like, I mean, it's not, like, the ideal thing. Mm Mm-hmm. To pry something open with. What about this? That could definitely pry something open. Um. Like, truly anything flat and metal could... Obviously, you need the clamp for something. Because there's a lot of other junk in here that you can't pick up. So the fact that you can pick this up implies that you need it. Yeah. Maybe you do have to jump up there. And then you can just pry it open. Do I just stand on the couch, maybe? Maybe. You gotta just jump. So I can clip through to the attic. <laughs> Might not be the answer we're looking for. <laughs> I feel like we're being really dumb. I, like, I, do I, I. I don't feel like this is the fault of the game. I feel like we're being <laughs> like, really stupid. I mean, considering we've missed so many things <laughs> that we could interact with like the first couple times. I I don't know if I just really can't be angry at another game or if no, we are me. just truly being incredibly stupid. You want me to look up a walkthrough? We've been playing for, I mean, this game's only supposed to take you like 30 minutes. We so. don't have a lot of time. <laughs> yeah. I'm not sure if this game has a walk. Oh, look at it. Uh, it's at shot. least it's not two days old. Maybe I shouldn't carry the clamp around because maybe that impedes what I can interact with. Although it hasn't so far. It just still usually tells me what I can interact with. There is a stick on the wall that you can pick up. And this? you put that in the vice. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, yeah, we are just being stupid. I said put it in the vice. In the vice? <laughs> is this just the vice? This is the vice. So then you tighten it. Yeah, I can gather that from here. I think that's all we need. <laughs> There was a light inside the dark room that we could turn on. And there was a a pipe somewhere in that room to bend the stick. 
So not the clan. Not the clan. So is this the light? Is this the light? Yes. My god, maybe- Why is suddenly everything- Why does everything work now? <laughs> is it because we were holding the clamp the whole time? Or do you have to do things in a certain order? Like you can't turn on the light until you get the pole or something like that. Maybe. Okay. I think, I think it's good. pretty straightforward what we gotta do now. <laughs> But hey, this okay. game actually has a walk through. Okay, we were just being peak stupid. Big dumb idiots. Alright. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Is it not like open enough? Hey! Give! <laughs> Give! <laughs> oh, it's broken. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> okay, so it's not the best, but it it's we're go we're going with it. Oh. Oh, get get smacked in the face. Mmm, oh, yeah. tasty insulation. Mm, That's sorry. a bad word. You can't say that here. <laughs> It's dark, oh, but we can see. So, does that mean that we can move on? Or what was that game where we were playing where, like, it was making us do something like, oh yeah, demons never lie, where they were like, you can't go down there because it's dark, and it was just like, hmm, I think I'll deal with it. <laughs> oh. Clip through, <laughs> casually clip through the rafters. That's okay. Ooh. Is there something over there? I don't see anything. Just go for it, dude. <laughs> All right. I don't like the fact that I can't like look down there. No, no, no. Go back up! <laughs> What's happening? There's nothing more terrifying than a horror game that, like, it doesn't work perfectly. Because oh then you, like, lose uh. control. Oh my god. Go, go up. <laughs> go up the ladder. I gotta, like, go back down and all the way first. Okay, so this game... No! <laughs> it's fine. Just go. Excuse Just run. Me. Just run forward. It's fine. The worst thing that's gonna happen is we're gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah! So, like, who cares, right? Oh, God. Do <laughs> we got blinded for a second? B. Oh, I think I can't. Do anything because it's saving. Oh no. Don't like when holding games save. It's not a good sign considering the conventions of a horror game, <laughs> but also considering the conventions of a puzzle game, which this also is, that's <laughs> fine. Yeah. I'm assuming that he captured and murdered somebody named Helen Woodward. Or oh, she lives here. <laughs> this is a house. <laughs> okay, I guess it's vaguely. Can. That's all you get. She didn't have any credit cards or a driver's license, just a library card. Hoo woo. Mmm, blood or brick dust. Brick dust, for sure. Who knows? <laughs> Me, it's brick dust. <laughs> the blood was very saturated. Ooh, we got some bolt cutters. I like that. Although the clamp wasn't useful at all. That's true. 
Who? <laughs> it's a toilet. <laughs> Why did that just go into my face? What the? <laughs> is a toilet. <laughs> That was a demonic laugh for a second when it first started. So I gotta find a hinge of some kind, but that's the problem. <laughs> I'm just gonna. I, I'm not sure if my strategy is good. <laughs> puzzle games work because usually the problem with puzzle games is I guess at the solution and then like I get too focused on like like with games we have to search for something I'm like I bet we need this and then I get too so so focused searching for that specific thing that I miss the thing we actually need and then to avoid that I usually just look at everything and grab everything mm -hmm. but in this game, if you can only do stuff in a certain order, then like, uh. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Mm. Maybe go back in the original room and see if we missed anything. Good plan. <laughs> Brick is embedded into the wall. Tasty. And not in the way that bricks usually are. Mm -hmm. Maybe the room where we found bolts. Let's just avoid the dark and spooky room for as long as possible. Yeah. There's an Amazon box. Nice. Package. Something on the window, so maybe. That looks like something. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I guess you can't make it out. <laughs> Probably will be able to later. So try to remember that those exist. Is that a crowbar up there? Yes. Yeah. Maybe try to pick up the thing on the windowsill without the bolt cutters. Yep. Oh. Oh, that's the thing to fix the bolt cutters. That's what mm -hmm. I thought it looked like. Uh-huh. Oh, Hello. <laughs> no, no. have to do it in the right order. Excuse me! <laughs> oh, I have to click it. Okay. <laughs> I just don't know the controls, yeah, I guess. I'm <laughs> getting the hang of it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Let's go to freedom. Is this freedom or is Definitely there, not. Gonna, it's gonna, oh. There's gonna be like a murderer standing <laughs> right behind the door like, hello. <laughs> <laughs> right. It is me. You know, I'm gonna feel really cheesed off if the dude that like eventually catches us like looks really scary because like you walked in there with this man and one of immediately like, that guy's a demon. So presumably he's just a guy, you know? <laughs> I feel like he can be like kind of like a spooky looking guy. Oh, shit. What? What? Is there someone coming? I don't. I don't see anything. <laughs> That's the worst. <laughs> when the character's like, ooh. And you're like, what? <laughs> <laughs> I don't see nothing. <laughs> Is there like a body on the ground? I don't know. That I thing ca might be a head. I don't know. <laughs> That's way too big. Look at it. How big it is like, compared to how far away we are from it. What is emerging out of the darkness at the end of that hallway? What? Nothing. It's just like the fence is waving and you can see something through it. Oh no. But it just looks like the roof of another house. I think we just gotta go again. <laughs> <laughs> Can 
Can I at least pick up something to defend myself? No. I don't even know if that's like a function in this <laughs> game. What was he swearing about? I don't know! <laughs> was that... it just that he thought this was a... A way out and it's closed off? So he oh, was like, oh what? man, it's maybe. closed off. Maybe, maybe. God, I'm getting cheesed <laughs> off about this. <laughs> you know, I put it Body on ground? No, it's, no, a, it's a wheelbarrow. Wheel part of the reason I picked this game was because in like the trailer thing, he had like some like sardonic like narration, uh -huh. and I was like, I feel like that'll make me like feel better if this guy's just like ah. <laughs> so like it was like he was trying to open a door, and then he was just like, why is everything always locked? <laughs> mm -hmm. So it's like I think that'll make me feel better. It is not making me feel better. May I offer you an egg in these trying times? Who <laughs> woo? It's nothing. So is this is nothing. That's definitely why he was like swearing. Yeah. It's because there's nothing here. Oh. oh. That fence scared me because it looked like a pair of jeans. <laughs> You're like, hello! I thought I just walked right into the legs of a very <laughs> stiff motor. <laughs> Got my blue <laughs> jeans on and I'm ready to go. Uh, whew. Yeah, anyway, he was definitely just swearing about, like... Can this not make such a scary noise when I drop it? Can I not get food here? Gotta open the door. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we should just leave the bolt cutters. I feel like if it was a mechanic that you could defend yourself with a weapon, they wouldn't make you put it down every time you had to do something. It makes me feel better. <laughs> Fine, then walk through the door like a... Like a not coward. <laughs> Go. The music cut off. You want me to look in the place in the walkthrough and see if there's a jump no, scare? No, I'll just. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I don't like this. <laughs> <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> Lights jump scare. <laughs> Christ on a cracker? Christ on a cracker. Hmm, door locked? Door probably locked. This door? Uh, that's fair enough, my guy? <laughs> Very fair, man. <laughs> I mean, there wasn't a way out backwards anyway. Normally I would... Hey, this is actually probably the first non-stupid horror game character for a while. Mm-hmm. Cause he was just you know, he was just bub. Mm-hmm. And he was like it was a little weird, but like not enough that most people would be like Nope. And like now he can't leave because he can't. Like he's trying to leave. That's the point of the game. It's not like some stupid nonsense. What is this? It looks important. You spin me right round, baby, right round. I think you're just gonna have to go the other way. Yeah, there's some stairs. Basement. Like a record, baby, right round, baby, right round. This is good. A place to cower. <laughs> I'm a fan of that. <laughs> We're a fan of cowardice here on the Dysfunctional <laughs> Place channel. More red stuff? Blood or normal construction nonsense? Who knows? I will now not walk around with a tool in my hand because that is apparently very cumbersome in this game. Where's the light switch? 
it's probably it's in, in so probably in yeah it's on the wall oh Hi. that's also a first for <laughs> <laughs> oh. a working light switch hey this part of the house looks like a house yeah there's also scary music playing and I'm cowering in the corner Until I can be determined that it is not, in fact, a musical cue and is just nothing. <laughs> um. I'm gonna say it's a musical cue. So stay here then? Oh, wait, no, it's not a musical cue. I think it's just. The music kicking back in. Generic IKEA furniture. <laughs> yeah. You know what I do like in horror games? Uh huh. Those like ones that let you like lean out of doors. Oh yeah. That's a mechanic I appreciate. Uh, it's honestly not much different than just half walking out the door. <laughs> but that's a human arm. Oh my. Oh god. I love how the the music <laughs> went in as <laughs> it we basically hid it from us. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that was a cue for finding a dead body, not because yeah. there's a motor coming from I us. know, I just Hi, are you Helen? You're probably Helen. Mmm, a bit stiff. She's, she's dead. Yeah. I, I mean to be fair. I'm not sure. Fair. Mm -hmm. The dude did just knock him out. That's true. It is not entirely unreasonable for this dude to think that he might have just knocked someone else unconscious. Too. That's fair. Uh, but also, much better reaction than from uh, the emulator when you walk outside and just say, What the heck? <laughs> when you see Sarah, it. what the heck? When, like, like <laughs> this is a random person. That you just found, and you had more, and this guy had more reaction than the main character, the emulator finding his girlfriend like dismembered, dismembered on the pavement. <laughs> uh, to be fair, it might help that this game has voice actors. Mm -hmm. The other game was just text, uh, although an exclamation point probably would have helped. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that's I don't like that at all. got some keys now. Okay, I'm getting the hang of the mechanics. Yes. Yikes. Not a fan of that. Me either, family am. <laughs> I mean, we were, like, dissing on some guy for his <laughs> reaction to disembowelment. We're just, like, not a fan. Okay, um, but we're playing a game. <laughs> well, how would you react if you walked into a room and saw, like, a real human <laughs> dead body on the floor? Probably vomit. <laughs> I don't even like being in the same room as a Flash mummy light. in a museum. <laughs> This is how flashlights look. <laughs> yeah. Are. Press F to equip hide the flashlight. No, it's helpful though. F. Press F. And, and I'm check. assuming the fact that it's in the other hand is Means the cue that, that we can keep it out. Yeah. This is a really empty. A you know, the setup of this being a house under construction. Very clever for, like, a low-budget indie game that doesn't want to model a bunch of fully furnished rooms. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like, 
You can have that creepy, desolate feeling and the lazy, this room is just empty, deal with it thing. Yeah. And just... Oh, I didn't want to do that. And just say it's because... It's under construction. And you know what? That's fine. It's like a found footage film. Like, it just gives you an excuse to, like, be worse and then still be good. <laughs> yeah. It's like it gives you an excuse to be cheap, but, like, it's st- you still pull it off and it still works. Which, like, honestly, that's fine. That opens ominously. Ooh. It's lagging a lot in this. Woof we. Is that really it? I hope so. I bet something's gonna chase us. Is there a splint? There is a splint. The shift is splint. nothing chasing us. <laughs> That's honestly more disconcerting than if something chased us. Really, I prefer it without being Cause chased. Because, like, we can't just get... That's too easy. <laughs> they can't just let us leave. Like, something else has gotta happen. I was prepared to be chased. Um, I wasn't prepared for anything else. Let me look at the walkthrough. It's um, really not the point of a horror movie. Okay, yeah, we're not outside, outside, outside the house. There's still more puzzles to solve. That's all I wanted to check. Okay. What else is new? These ones are increasingly more ominous. I want to go back to the rooms that had like the well wit half furnished rooms, not the ones filled with piles of bloody, gummy steel and bathtubs. Yeah. Grimy was the word I was <laughs> looking for. Gummy. <laughs> when my brain just said gummy. And I was like, that's not correct. But like, I think it's close. That's probably the dumbest thing I've ever done. Mmm, <laughs> grummy. <laughs> Ooh, woo. What? <laughs> oh. Lights? A light. I was really like, expecting there to be a dead body on the floor in there, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> well, I wasn't. I was just like, lights. I mean, this dude clearly isn't super into hiding yeah, just, his corpses. He just threw some cardboard over one of them. <laughs> I think it was a door. I'm pretty yeah. sure it was cardboard. I'm pretty sure it was a door. The walkthrough said it was cardboard. <laughs> well, it looked like a door. I thought it looked like cardboard. <laughs> so I guess I gotta find something. A key. Yeah, or something to break it with. Yeah. Some vault cutters, perhaps. She's a maniac. Maniac! A suspiciously stained tub? Yeah. I love suspicious stains. Totally. So did this dude just knock us out and, like, peace out? Yes. Like, I feel like he would have noticed us wandering around. You know, the person he, like, just assaulted. I think he just peaced out. Like, you think if you just knocked someone out and then left them lying on the floor, you would, like, keep an eye out for them waking up? Yeah. That's where we came from. Don't go back in there. (laughs) I didn't want to, so, like, Mm -hmm. I'm really glad. I like everything. Something I 
can grab. Really, the sound design is very effective. I'm not a fan of the big floodlight in the yard. No, it makes me feel very exposed. <laughs> me too. Like, in the house, the floodlights were, like, nice. Mm-hmm. Because it was, like, much more brightly lit than I would be accustomed to. Now that we're, like, out in the open. Mm-hmm. Because, like, you know, if someone's in a room with you, they're going to see you regardless. Now that we're out in the open, I feel like I would feel safer in the dark. Yeah. Because I'd be like, I can't see, but neither can anyone else. And unlike in a room, they probably won't be able to find me. Mm-hmm. Why don't we just scale over the wall and fucking Really? Like just drag this over and just... Like, I don't have that much dexterity. I'm not an athletic person, but, like, I feel like I could climb that wall. Especially with adrenaline on my side. Like, <laughs> I probably couldn't, but if I could, like, drag a couple boxes over, I could. Mm-hmm. Those leaves, like, popped up, like, waved over, and I was like... <laughs> <laughs> Very cool. This is so far the most effective horror game that we have played thus far. I'm actually having, like, kind of a good time. Having a good time, having a like, good time. It's scary enough where I'm like, yeah, this is a horror game, but like, n scary enough, but like also not so scary that I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> and it also functions. It's a functional game that like works and stuff. That's Shooting good. Star leaping through the sky like, like a tiger, tiger defying the, the laws, laws of gravity. gravity. <laughs> I'm gonna look at the walkthrough. We don't got time for this. Yeah. Like, I, I know it's not good content, but, like, I'm not even... I don't know, man. Should I go oh. get the wire You wanna cutters? head to the building with three windows. This is the storage shed. The door is blocked by a number of stone tiles. You can just pick them up and drop them somewhere else. This will allow you to open the door. I'm assuming we did that already. No, I've never I... moved. I haven't moved anything. Okay. This is a building with... No, this has more than this. There's a room with three windows. No, there's four. Yeah, so I said, what is the building with the three windows? Is, is that I it? I don't know. What? Are you looking at the right part of the walkthrough? I think so. It says, you have now entered the garden. This oh, part of the guide... Oh. Didn't even know this was a building. Sick. To be honest. Those are what's blocking the door... <laughs> You have to individually <laughs> pick these up and move them to open the door. Ooh. <laughs> I did that with a lot of confidence. Yeah, every time you, you open a door, I'm afraid there's just gonna be a man standing yeah, there. Yeah, usually I am, so usually I, like, poop home. I, like, psych myself up before opening a door, but I was just, like, ready to go. Well, I'm glad I looked at the walkthrough, because we were not remotely <laughs> in the right place. <laughs> Did not realize this was a building. Well, all the other buildings were locked, so I figured that is where we need to go. Inspect the workbench. What were you supposed to do? Inspect the workbench. It's a broken ladder. I think that ladder is functional enough, my man. <laughs> oh! <laughs> okay.
Hello, I am a wee human <laughs> who is really reading this letter to you. Alright, I guess there's nothing else. Right. Seriously, why do I hold the flashlight this way? Just like up in the air. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, it'll be that way. <laughs> Alright, well that didn't help us at all. When is this game supposed to take place anyway? Look at the... She's been holding some scaffolding <laughs> for like 18 years. <laughs> Help. Okay, we just leave and go to the garage now. Cool, which one's the garage? I don't know. It doesn't say. Probably the one that's not locked. Uh, select your keys and open the door. Oh, God, I forgot about the keys. I'm an idiot. I figured we already used the keys. No. For what they were good for. No. How do I switch between things in my inventory? Didn't you use the keys to unlock that one door? I don't know how to select the keys. Okay, here we go. Yeah, I'm just a dumb idiot. <laughs> I thought we used them to open the door to let out here. Well, there's two keys on it anyway. That's true. But, like, God, we're so stupid. <laughs> Make sure to retrieve the keys from the lock. Hello, crowbar. No. Did don't... you retrieve the keys from the lock? Suddenly, different voice. <laughs> Sometimes your voice actor changes halfway through, and that's just how it be. <laughs> <laughs> so, open fuse boxes. I guess there's a fuse box to open. I guess I should select them, <laughs> probably. <laughs> <laughs> Don't make that cut. Hello. Is this a fuse box? I don't know what a fuse box is. I don't know what a fuse box looks like. <laughs> Please. <laughs> I'm assuming that that's not what we're looking for. This is a lightly glitchy way of walking. That's it. Come on, like, this looks like a fuse box, doesn't it? Yeah, but it doesn't have anywhere to, like, put it. I don't know if they Use have... the switch next to the garage's rolling door. Ah. <laughs> After holding it for a moment, the power will cut out and a piece of the ceiling will collapse. I don't think we're in the right building. But the keys. I think those keys are just like universal keys. <laughs> oh god. <sighs> That tree keeps doing that. It keeps randomly <laughs> spawning into existence, and I hate it. I didn't like that at all. Please let me run. Spoony, spoony. Is that that's a gas can? Can I select the geese? Probably. Okay. I guess it didn't work. Unless. <laughs> no, the keys. Universal are... keys! Open. What in the world is that? Oh god, okay, something's gonna happen. Yeah, um. I accidentally read it out to you. <laughs> This is the thing we gotta use. Oh. <laughs> 
<laughs> okay, we made that noise. <laughs> yeah, I figured it was the switch. I was just like, why isn't like anything happening? Anyway, we uh, circumvented. Like something's gonna happen when I open the garage door. Okay. Uh, we now need to return power to the garage. But first we need to get the climber achievement. No, we don't need to get the climber achievement. <laughs> That's what it says in the walkthrough. <laughs> the walkthrough is incorrect. <laughs> what if we need to climb when we're getting chased by the murderer? Then that is the... Achievements do not grant you abilities! Okay. Why, why can't I use this on the fuse box? I don't know. I'll just skip over this. Okay. Now you need to head to the back side of the building. There will be some scaffolding. There, what? Did that door just open or did it just spawn into being? What door? What door? Where door? What do you mean? Okay, it just spawned into being. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Scap. Great. Use the piece of ladder you have on the half-constructed ladder. I don't have a piece <laughs> of a ladder. <laughs> um, am I supposed to get this? Give me the ladder! I can't! Are you sure that's not for the climber achievement? Maybe it is. Okay, look towards the old house down the path left of the shed. Why can't I just Okay, go back to the place where the grape that we opened was. What? Go back to the place with the... Go to the... The... This? Yes. What great... The, the metal thing that we opened. The door? It's a great door. <laughs> okay. You'll find a black bat inside the room. Open it up. Okay, fuse box yeah. key. Yeah. Leave the old house and head back towards the main house. Oh my god. <laughs> Just what am I supposed to do? Okay, enter me. the main house through the door. Just past the pallets. So the door we came from... I guess. It's dark now. Head upstairs. Why? <laughs> why? <laughs> tell me why. I'm not doing it until you tell me why. Head upstairs and enter the room on your right. You will find a fuse box. Is that thing in the garage not a fuse box? It's not a good enough fuse box. Is this a fuse box? Yes. Good lord. Read the hanging document underneath it. Make sure to flip through the pages until the end. You will f find a final excerpt talking about the fuse box key. Click it until you hear the audio narration. Use the fuse box okay, key can, on the fuse can box. Can I read things? Honey, if the circuit trips again, first turn on the OCD switch, then, and then the rest of them, the orange one last. Make, Make sure you first hear a click after you turn the OCD on. It may take a couple of seconds, otherwise it will trip again. I need to take a look at this before we hand the keys over to the new owner. If the circuit trips oh. again... Show the small one, and then all the other ones. Which orange one's one the left. Small one. Where's the orange one? 
They're just red and black. Oh, you sure there's not orange? Well, there's multiple of them. These are already on. These are already on. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh. The way just attacked again. Fuck. Stop swearing. <laughs> Or did we just get like electrocuted? Should I take this thing out? I can't. Oh, the light was out because the circuit broke. Alright, okay, so I guess we, now we go to the garage. The flashlight's broken. Is it? We don't have it anymore. It says in the walkthrough it'll be broken. We're almost done! Yeah, this game's pretty short. Um, ah! <laughs> something's definitely gonna happen when I open this door, though. Okay. Exit the main. Don't tell me things anymore. Okay. We don't need it. Okay. I can't do anything right now. Okay. The game is saving. But that means nothing will happen to you right now. <laughs> nothing has happened. <laughs> that, I mean, we got shocked or something. I know, it's just... I mean, not in, like, a bad way, just in, like, a, you know, we haven't been, like, attacked or anything. <laughs> just don't want there to be, like, feet right there. <laughs> Should I just like go for it? <laughs> this opens so slowly. Oh god. Run! Get away from me. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> did he catch us? I think so. <laughs> <laughs> if it did, that'd be very pretty cool by me. Well, at least now we know that there's a mysterious man ready to chase us. Um, I mean, I figured that. I figured uh, he'd just be on. I figured there would be. I just figured he'd be on the other side of the door. Uh huh. Okay, well, now we know. And we also know that it's not scary if we get caught. The screen just goes black and then the game almost crashes. <laughs> <laughs> so, should I, like, stand? I don't want to stand with my back to the door. But, like, I should stand closest to you, right? Give me, give me validation. I don't know. <laughs> Tell me what to do. <laughs> um, I don't know. I mean, we can't like look at the door anyway when we do this. So yeah. Like... Just, I'm sure it'll give us a musical cue. Go now. Go, run. I can't. Go, walk. I can't. Aw, oh, man. But. Really? <laughs> Come on. Oh, don't oh, do man. that. man. Don't close it. <laughs> ah, run. <laughs> <laughs> go, 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 go. Climb gate. Oh, he's gone. <laughs> You're under arrest. We're under arrest? Yeah, the guy's the other guy's gone. Her name is Garrett, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> they probably just and we were the only person there. This is what happened. He was chasing me with a rod in his hand. He must have hidden when he saw the police cars. Malcolm, we searched the yard thoroughly and didn't find any evidence suggesting there was another man. No, 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 he was there. He was the owner who called me. The former owners sold the house due to personal financial problems two weeks ago. They moved to a different town on the other side. 
sick. <laughs> Depressing ending? Yeah. Wow. Uh. Well, not only did we play um, the whole game in one sitting, um, but it also worked and made sense and got our heart rate up a little bit. So this is the best game that we've played <laughs> so far. And again, we bought one that was $20. Um, so yeah, that was blameless. Uh, if you liked this video and uh, want to be notified every time we upload, which <laughs> will be a lot in the next <laughs> coming days, uh, you can hit the notification bell. Oh, there's more. Ooh, woo. <laughs> All right. Anyway. Well, I'm leaving this a glowing review on Steam. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you can hit the notification bell, or you can follow us on Twitter or join our Discord. Um, if you do join our Discord, read the rules, because a lot of people haven't been doing that. We put out a notification every time we upload. Um, but most importantly, join the Nerd Herd. It's a dysfunctional place, and that's pretty much it. Goodbye. Bye. Bye.